hi guys welcome back to my channel for those of you who are new welcome welcome to my channel my name is maria so today i'm gonna be doing a makeup video pretty much gonna be a get ready with me so if you want to see my makeup routine um keep on watching this will be my um, makeup routine and foundation routine that I use when I do go out to the baile to the haripeo this will be that so a lot of people every time I go out they ask me how do you get such a full coverage how do you do your eyeshadow how do you do this well honey this is the time where I'm going to be showing you all that and if you want to see the products that I use to make my makeup last all day at the haripeo and all night at the baile then keep on watching so I obviously did my eyebrows off camera I struggle a lot with my eyebrows. I went to this lady who threaded my eyebrows and completely ruined them. So even though my brows are a complete disaster right now, I'm gonna go ahead and ignore it and continue with the look. So I am, I already primed my eyelids. I'm gonna be using the Jaclyn Hill armed and gorgeous palette it is part of her bulk collection so i'm going to be going in with the color agent which is the burnt color up here in the corner i'm just going to take a little bit of that and i'm going to get started so when i do my makeup i like to use you know i like to put the same color at the same time on both eyes i know a lot of people like to do one eye and it's just quicker i think that it's quicker for me to do that but you know, everyone has their own way of doing their makeup. I think that's just the biggest part, like being, feeling beautiful in your own skin. I just, to me, that's just the most important part about makeup and getting ready. It's just, it doesn't matter si te critican o no te critican. Like, I've had so many people and like family members um, tell me like, cuando estés viejita, your skin's gonna be ugly, se te va a ver feo. And I'm like, I don't care. I'd rather be viejita and arrugada and know that I enjoyed my skin, you know, that when I was like young and that I felt beautiful when I would wear my makeup than be 60 years old, full of wrinkles and be like, damn, I wish I was gang again because I didn't, um, you know, I didn't enjoy those moments when my skin was so beautiful. It's gonna happen to all of us, but I just rather disfrutar la vida and disfrutar, you know, my young um, years because I know that I'm not gonna be young forever. So now I'm gonna use the color classified here in this corner. I'm actually not, I don't love it, but I also don't hate it, so. So now that I have that, I'm going to go ahead and add some liner and pop on my lashes um, and then be right back with some winged liner. Okay, so I am all done with my eyes and I pop on some lashes. 
So these are Lily Lashes in the Style Miami. So these are just my go-to lashes. I have tried other lash brands, but Lily Lashes is just my... I come back to it every single time. Like So, so now I'm just going to go ahead and prime my face. I use the baby skin primer by maybelline this is about four or five dollars this is like the perfect dupe for um the benefit professional i used to buy the benefit professional and that one and then one day online i just saw that um someone posted i think it was on pinterest that this was a dupe for it and i was like um, you know, like I, if I have to pay $25 for a good product, like I will pay it just because my makeup is like a very important part of me, you know, who I am as a person. But if I could save myself like a few bucks, trust me, like if you use that primer, like, and you have oily skin, it's perfect because, you know, it won't, your face won't get shiny at all. But I also feel like it will have to do a lot with your foundation. So I am wearing the Kat Von D foundation. I am in the shade 57 medium. I could, I think that the other shade that I could go for is um, 56 or 55. I can't remember. But it's just, I personally like to have like that. I have like golden undertone. So I just like this foundation because... I like to I like to look a little yellow, you know, like I don't like to exactly match my color. So that is the reason why I love this color. And usually I always blend it into my ears as well, just because I like my ears to match. But since I am already wearing my hoops, I do not want to do that right now. And honestly, if you try the Kat Von D foundation, you won't want to go back. This foundation is honestly like so, so, so good. Like it is honestly really, really, really good. Like you will love it if you try this foundation. It will last you the whole baile, the whole haripeo, wherever you are at. It will last you the whole time that you are there. It's I love this foundation and I don't think that I could ever go back to anything else. I do have, I do own other foundations and I use, I do have other products that I use on a day to day basis. But for the sake of going out to a party or going out to a baile or just going out on a day where I want my makeup to last all day, pretty much for any occasion other than daily use this is my go-to foundation so i like to apply it with a foundation brush on any obviously any kabuki brush i love which those are the flat ones for now i haven't washed my favorite um foundation brush so i used this one which was clean you know but it doesn't matter because i like to use a damp sponge just to give it more of an airbrush finish and honestly i guarantee you like that doing this will actually soften up if you apply your foundation with a brush to using a damp beauty blender over it it definitely definitely helps you know just give you a more flawless airbrush look so pretty much this is my violin haripeo or you know going out lasting all night um makeup so now i'm gonna go ahead and set it i know that baking for a lot of people is like out like that's not a thing anymore i still bake my face even though there's other you know people use powder many different ways i still bake my face just because i have an oily face so i have to make sure that i try to keep my face as matte as possible throughout the day and night so i use the air spun powder which looks like this i use translucent extra coverage so i use the extra coverage one i haven't tried any other air spun 
um, shade just because that one works perfect for me. I usually put it on the cap and, you know, do that. Then put my beauty blender in it and apply it under my eyes, close to my nose. Bring it out like that. So about 10 minutes have passed and now that my face, you know, has baked for a bit, what I do is that I take this fluffy brush, getting all that powder out of my face. What I like to do, I bronze up my face. I use, I have two, my two go-to bronzers. The first, this one is the NYX um, Matte Bronzer in the shade 03. done with this look I am gonna take my favorite highlighter of all times honestly this brand is amazing if you have not checked them out I will link everything down below this is the Vive Cosmetics highlighter duo in the shades Reina and Diosa my mirror broke on it but that's fine um, it's my the two shades are still perfectly fine so I it's okay the mirror it's fine I have other mirrors but this highlighter is like amazing for an everyday wear for going out it, but it's so intense but it could also be very subtle like if you're not very much into highlighter i like to add it on my inner corners on my cheeks i like to take one of these a blend just a regular blending brush today i'm wearing diosa which is this darker shade so I just like to take that and, you know, put it on my brow bone and it just intensifies any look that you're trying to do. I should have used Reina today just because of my eyeshadow, you know, choice. But, oh well, this, is, this will do for today. So now, just to top it off, I'm going to add some li lipstick and I'll be right back. No te critica, no te da la espalda Este no siente envidia El amigo es el que está Cuando tú lo necesitas Okay, so I added some lipstick and lip liner For lipstick, I am using the shade Maria By Vive Cosmetics This is my favorite shade in the entire world I have been using this non-stop since I purchased it I want to say like oh, like six months, seven months, eight months. I don't know. I lost count. I literally use this every single time that I go out. I have been using this shade nonstop. I love it so much. Vivid Cosmetics is just my go-to brand. I love their lipsticks. I love their highlighter. I just cannot wait to see what else they come up with. And then I also forgot to mention, but I did set my face with the Mario Badescu Rose Water. This is my go-to setting spray. But yeah, so pretty much this is my foundation routine for when I do go to the baile or jaripeo or if I'm going to a party, a quinceañera. You know, if I'm just, if I know that I'm going to go dance, this is what I do on my skin. I pretty much, it's like, these are my two best 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 friends and of course i cannot leave out my airspun powder it's just such a good product and it's only like five bucks at walmart um all of the products that i pr pretty much mentioned on here is what i use on my um going to the violet foundation routine like i said if i ever update my foundation routine i will post a video on it but for now this is what keeps my oily face um on check so this concludes this video and i hope that um you find this video helpful one way or another and if you ever try my going to the baile foundation routine please let me know let me know if you try any of these products and let me know if you like it if you have any video suggestions please let me know i hope that you enjoyed this video i'm so happy to finally have my youtube um channel up and running once again if there's anything that you want to see, please let me know. I know that this is a weird get ready with me 
foundation routine but it's just you know um i just want to make sure that i'm finally up and running with this channel again i am trying to get up on it and trust me there's a lot of more videos coming with my sister and um i have a lot of things planned for this channel if there's anything else that you're interested in knowing or watching or if you have any questions also feel free to go follow me on instagram at marilupe underscore underscore i don't post a lot of makeup related things on there but i am trying to do so most of it it's about like my family my personal life um but if you are interested in following me go ahead and always remember that what makes your makeup beautiful is you and there's no rules to makeup as long as you feel confident in your own skin so even if you don't have like i'm not you know i don't have major makeup skills but I, just knowing that i created this look on myself makes me feel so proud and so happy because you know makeup is a form of art and expressing yourself and if you are like me you know i feel that when every time i do my makeup i have um, an opportunity to create you know and having myself as my own canvas is the most beautiful thing ever of course i do makeup on other people as well um, like family members my sister my mom but you know at the end of the day i just love doing makeup on my own and i'm not claiming to be a professional makeup artist but if there's anything that i could ever do you know to help other people feel more confident and you know really bring up you know their confidence in makeup i will do so so thank you so much for tuning into this video i hope that you guys enjoyed my makeup routine my going to the vitale foundation routine i hope to see you on the next one Bye bye